Okay, hi everyone and welcome back to day, I think it's, I don't even know, eight, seven? I'm so confused. Um, I don't even know what day it is, but um, we'll, we'll know when the video goes out. Um, anyway, today we are going to Magic Kingdom, yay! So we are heading to Magic Kingdom, we have a reservation for Crystal Palace, so we can't wait to eat there. We're gonna have such a great day, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. I can't wait to bring you guys along. Um, also, if you're new here, thank you so much for tuning in, and I hope you like enjoy this video. And don't forget to subscribe because we have had a week full of videos and we have a week more to go on this holiday. So there's loads of content to come. So to make sure you don't miss out on any of that, be sure to hit the subscribe button. I would really appreciate it as I'm on your new channel and I'm trying to grow. And I've loads of Disney vlogs coming in the future. And I've had a Disneyland Paris vlog series back in November. So be sure to check that out. So yeah, also, Check out me and Holly's Instagram, it's at Mickey's number dot one pals where we uh, share all of our Disney pics, all of our universal pics, everything from this trip will be there, previous trips, future trips, everything, you name it. We do hauls and all, we do loads, so be sure to check that out. Um, so yeah, like I said, we're heading to Magic Kingdom, we're so excited. Um, I've already made one lightning lane this morning and it was for Jungle Cruise and it's not till this evening, that one was very popular and I wanted to wait till later on in the day to do it, so I think it's 5.25 or something like that it's for so we haven't done that yet so I'm looking forward to that and I think I'm able to make another lightning lane at 11 ish so yeah I'll bring you guys along with me and we're gonna go to Crystal Palace we're gonna do loads of stuff hopefully see enchanting tonight fingers crossed so let's get into today's video let's go to breakfast okay guys my breakfast is here and no surprise I got the double berry uh, pancake but me and my mum decided to split it so she has one pancake there and she got two little bacon bashers because she didn't want uh, hash brown and all and then I got a bit of it. yeah a little bit and then I got the bacon and we'll split the egg and she'll have a bit of hash brown yeah and we're gonna dig into this my dad got what was it what omelette is it called the ultimate ultimate omelette so I don't know there's loads on that with peppers and all it's not my cup of tea if you ask me but yeah we're gonna dig in guys we're in the magic kingdom yay i literally have not updated you in a bit but we're just walking in the magic kingdom now i didn't even explain that holly wasn't even at breakfast with us um wait can you guys even see me yeah you can i didn't explain that holly wasn't at breakfast she was having a bit of a lie-in weren't you yeah she was a bit tired from last night in animal kingdom so she took a little bit of a rest this morning that's why she wasn't there then i sorted myself out and now we are here at Magic Kingdom, we just walked in. People are saying, oh Holly, oh the Winnie the Pooh characters and I'm in my Winnie gear. Oh my God, guys, I hope they see my gear. Oh my God, this is the best moment. I have my Winnie ears and top on. Let me see. Here they are, guys, this is amazing. <laughs> Hi guys! Oh my god. <laughs> Hi Winnie! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Do you like my ears, Winnie? You're on my ears <laughs> and my top. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Oh guys, this is actually so cute. Oh my god guys, we loved that as soon as we walked in the Winnie characters. Holly was saying that she really liked that because in what Paris they just have Mickey and Minnie. Yeah. So that was really nice. Speaking of Mickey, we're actually heading in to meet him. It's saying it's five minutes, so 
we can't resist. We can't pass that up. Um, we're gonna go into them. I might film it on my phone for Instagram. What do you think, Holly? Yeah, do that. Yeah. So you guys won't see me and Mickey. I'll try and insert a picture if I remember. Um, yeah, it's only posting a five minute. We did it the other day when uh, the footage was severely zoomed in, wasn't a halt. Like, but uh, yeah, we're gonna go in. The queue isn't even long at all. But yeah, that was so cute with uh, Winnie and Tigger, Rabbit, Piglet, the whole gang. I absolutely love that and I'm, I love it because I was in my, my little gear and he's on my top there as well. Um, but yeah, we have a reservation for Crystal Palace today, like I said earlier, and that is at three o'clock. So in 35 minutes, we have um, the reservation. We came to the park a little bit later today, again, because Holly was tired and yeah, we needed to rest after last night, didn't we? Yeah. So we, we knew we had a reservation, so we said we'll come and then we will see the park at night time. And then I went for breakfast this morning. Holly had a little bit of a dip in the pool then. Um, she got up, did you guess what? You got a cinnamon roll in Starbucks, didn't you? So, and a coffee. And she sat at the pool and then she got in. I didn't get in the pool today. I was just lying on the sunbed posting her Instagram uh, from Animal Kingdom yesterday. That was what I was up to. So let's go and we'll, we'll see Mickey. I'll let you guys know how the meet with Mickey went because I will film it on my phone for Instagram because you guys seen it the other day. Even though the footage was zoomed in, it's better than nothing. <laughs> Okay guys, we came out of meeting Mickey and he was lovely, wasn't he, Holt? Yeah, he was great. We're hoping we found our new profile pic for Instagram. Because <laughs> our profile pic we've had since we started the page and it was taken in 2018. Yeah. So, if only, when we get, when you get to like hug them again, we'll get another one kissing yes, them. Yes, exactly. But for now, we'll have to do it. For now, we'll have to deal with a social distance one. Because our profile pic is uh, kissing his cheeks back in 2018 and we haven't changed it since, but we think we're due an upgrade. Oh, I nearly fell. Jesus. I keep nearly falling on this it's, trip. I think it's that, yo. How many times have I tripped in these vlogs? I should make a compilation, I'm telling you. But yeah, we just met him, super cute. We filmed it for Instagram. So yeah, we're just coming towards the castle now. So I'll show you guys the castle. Guys, we're walking down Main Street and Mickey's Magical Friendship Fair is on. So we're just um, staying back here a little bit, but we found the cast and agency door uh, in Magic Kingdom and it's so much more easier to find yeah. than the one in Paris. Like it's right, it's very noticeable. Like in the one in Paris, it's like hidden in a little, like kind of nearly, I don't know how to describe it. It's like turned in ways. Like, yeah, somewhere. it's one of those things where if you know where it is, you know. Yeah. If not, then you don't. We, we still struggle to find it. Oh yeah, 100%. But that one was right on the street, like no, kind of twist in to find it so we got our little pictures there at the casting agency and yeah it was it was great now the Mickey's magical friendship fair is just over now and um, I didn't want to show the castle because I didn't want to we didn't want to see the show because we're gonna try and see that ourselves later on and um, but we'll go towards the castle maybe take a few pictures just while we're waiting on our reservation it's in about a half an hour from now we'll get some pics and yeah, it's a really lovely day today. It is roasting out, oh my God. We are literally gonna be baked alive. And the last day we were here was pretty warm as well. So we've been very lucky with weather since we got here, but it is very, very, very busy. Uh, it's very, very busy today, um, but that's always expected in Magic Kingdom. So we'll, we'll get a good day in regardless of that though. Okay guys, I keep saying I'm gonna show the castle and I still haven't. We got our photos taken, we were watching a marching band, but just look at that. I will never get over this castle. It is absolutely magnificent. And I do really have to say, I love the whole um, 50th anniversary colors on them. I think it's beautiful, I really do. What do you think of the 50th design? It's nice. Yeah. When last time we were here, obviously it was blue like Cinderella. Oh yeah. Yeah. But I have to say, I do like these colours. So, there you go. Take that beauty in. It's just amazing. It really is. I'm actually taking about 400 photos as well, but it just it has to be done. We'll go up a bit closer and we'll just have a nosy. Amazing, and we'll come back later for Enchantment and Mickey's Friendship Fair, which is on a few more times today, so you will get to see that. But yeah, how amazing. 
Okay guys, we are just approaching Crystal Palace for our reservation now. Oh my God, we're starving, aren't we, Holly? Oh, I can't wait for this. It looks unreal. So as far as I'm aware, the vibe I get is this place is uh, Walt Disney World's uh, Plaza Gardens. Um, and Plaza Gardens is our favorite restaurant in Disneyland Paris. So I think this is gonna be similar. So I can't wait. Um, it used to be uh, character dining with the Winnie the Pooh characters, but since COVID, it hasn't came back yet. Character meet and greets are slowly but surely coming back to Walt Disney World. We're doing one on Saturday. I won't give it away just yet, but this one isn't one yet, but we wanted to eat here. So we're gonna do it. Let's go. Oh my God, guys, we are here in Crystal Palace. I hope you guys can hear me. It is a bit loud in here, but we have made it to Crystal Palace and we have a lovely seat. I'm sitting just against the bushes here and Holly is sitting in front of me, but she's gone to get food. But yeah, she's gone to get food. Um, it's an all you can eat buffet, so we are gonna eat to our heart's content. We'll probably be here for about an hour before our class passes and all start for the day. So I am absolutely buzzing for this. This is my dream restaurant. Thank you. Perfect, thank you. So yeah, um, we're here. Holly's gone up to get food. I'm gonna get a plate of food. And if I remember, I will try and bring you guys around this restaurant, like even to see the buffet or something. If I remember, you know me, I forget absolutely everything. My Coke Zero just arrived, oh my God. That's unbelievable. I really needed a sub and coke. Oh my god, that's so nice. Um, Festival of Fantasy Parade is about to begin on Main Street and this restaurant is just outside of Main Street beside Casey's Corner. So we might see the floats in the distance going by because we have a really great seat near the window. So yeah, I hope I can see it. Oh, Holly's back with a little plate. Let's see what she got. What did you get? Um, Tater tots. Oh. Fried chicken, a beef quesadilla, some sausage and macaroni and cheese. Lovely. And Holly's going to dig into that and I'm going to go and get something to eat. Okay guys, I got my first little um, plate of food and I got the weirdest selection. Now first of all, this is mashed potato and it doesn't look, I don't even know what to say about it. I wanted to try it to see, maybe it might actually be nice so I didn't want to judge. I got some rice because you can't go wrong, a little slice of pizza some tater tots and I think this is um, southern fried chicken. Very weird selection but I just wanted to try them all so I'll let you guys know how this goes. Okay guys we are on plate number two. I got myself some more rice because it was unbelievable. This is country fried chicken. I don't know what sauce is on it and then some sort of what is this pork or beef? Beef. Brisket, Brisket beef and then some corn on the cob. So I'm going to dig into this hopefully it's all nice the food so far has been really really nice okay guys plate number three which will be the last of food because i'm getting really full and then i'm on to dessert so i got some more tater tots some more corn because that was unreal and then um is this steak is it or uh some steak and it looks really nice and uh the chef cut it right in front of you so amazing so you know that it's completely fresh she's doing it up in front of you and this restaurant is absolutely amazing guys are you loving it so far yeah, so yeah. they're definitely worth the money yeah so we're gonna dig in holly was on plate number what three, three. and you're getting dessert soon yeah after this. yeah grand so we'll dig in okay guys i have got dessert holly's gonna have to help me with some of the names because i can't remember I don't know them. you don't know them either right well we've got a, a chocolate chip cookie and this was the butterscotch pudding butterscotch pudding with toffee popcorn on top this i actually don't know i think it might be strawberry shortcake strawberry shortcake holly thinks it might be and then this just a chocolate muffin is it yeah belgian chocolate probably this was something s'more i think there's a s'more in it s'mores something like that yeah and what i really like about this restaurant is that um on some of the desserts i got one of everything so this was everything there was except an apple cookie did you get the apple cookie um no it's apple crumble apple crumble did you get it oh sorry um they all not all of the desserts but some of them said um walt's favorite so they picked a lot of desserts that walt used to love when he was alive which i thought was really nice so it would say walt's favorite on it if um if you liked it so yeah i'm gonna dig into this this looks unreal 
Right guys, I decided to do a little taste test for you guys like I did in, where were we, the art? Downtown. Why was I going to say? I was going to say the art of Marvel. But anyway, I'll do a little taste test. So, chocolate chip cookie. It's really soft. That's nice. You can tell that's freshly baked. Did you get one? No, I got the plain sugar cookie. <laughs> Was it nice? Yeah. Okay, I'll get the plain sugar cookie. I didn't see them. Um, oh, I thought they were the apple. I don't know. Something said apple. I'm confused. Anyway. Chocolate um, chip cookie. Unreal. really can tell it's freshly baked. Next, I'm going to try the s'more something. I don't know what it's called, but it's the s'more in the middle. Oh, I need a fork for that. Right. Let me see. Oh Holly, there's chocolate inside as well. Let me see. It is literally breaking on the, on the fork. Okay, this is it. There's a bit of s'more there, a bit of chocolate and a bit of the crumbly bit. Oh my god. That is nice. That's really nice. That's what it looks like on the inside. It's like the end of a cornetto. It is like the end of a cornetto actually, now that you say it. That was good. I like that. Right. We'll try the porter. What was it? Porter. Porter scotch pudding. Porter scotch pudding. You liked it, didn't you? Right. So Holly liked it. Let's see if I like it. But the desserts are really nice in here. Yeah. Sometimes in Paris they're a bit dodgy. Yeah, sometimes. Remember when the Frozen Celebration oh, was on? Yeah. In Paris they had a Frozen Celebration on in 2020. The desserts were not nice. They just had Elsa's face on it and that was it. Yeah. And they weren't nice at all. Now last time we went, what were they? They were okay. Yeah, in the downtown they were nice. Downtown they were nice. Yeah, Plaza Gardens. I think they were just like, there was a Mickey Brownie I remember it was nice. Yeah, that was nice. Something, the mini cake was that nice. Yeah. Yeah, but these so far are really good. Okay, so we'll try, um, this we think is a shortcake, is that what you said? Yeah. Yeah, with strawberry and cream on top. Let me see. Don't fall. It's the little chocolate muffin, which I'm sure is nice. Okay, let's give this a go. Yeah, that's really soft, really fresh. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Oh my god. Guys, I recommend this restaurant 100% to you. Yeah, it's real good. It's worth the money. Worth the money. We think it's 35 per person plus tax. Um, and we've actually gotten a lot of refills. So we think it's... Um, we think it's free re refills. We're not too sure. We had a little bit of a catastrophe when we arrived. So I don't know. Maybe I had a catastrophe. I'll explain when we get out of the restaurant. So maybe he's just giving us free drinks because of that. But we don't know. But he's come down with like, like three pokes for me, hasn't he already? Like, and I thought we were only supposed to get one, but it was three refills, happy days. But definitely, if you're coming to Magic Kingdom, do come here. It's an all you can eat buffet. Totally worth the holly, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, we'll definitely be coming here again, won't we? Yeah. Next time we come here, this is definitely on the list. It's exactly like Plaza Gardens, but I think it's like nearly a little bit nicer or something. Yeah, maybe. Like I love Plaza Gardens, but yeah. the desserts are nicer. Yeah, that's it. And the beef was very nice as well, wasn't it? So I'm gonna finish my dessert and I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Okay guys, I'm gonna very quickly show you around the food of Crystal Palace. So this is the desserts I'm starting with. There's the cookies, apple cobbler, 
and fresh baked cookies and then this is um, apple pie no chocolate vanilla chocolate vanilla oh my chocolate vanilla swirl oh, I don't know why I said that about five times I'm I don't even know and then there's more desserts they're the stuff that we got earlier on I got every single dessert so that's down there and there's actually a really long queue for the food but I'll just show you around this way first of all there is the chef cutting the steak the food is the same on both sides so I'll just show one side but there's the chef cutting the steak and then you come here and we've got sauces and then here is all the food just along here there's a lot of people so I won't be able to show you guys properly but just so you get an idea of what the place looks like and then we've got salads and all yeah and then a little kitty station over here and um, I can't really show you the place is getting very very busy now but yeah it's fab in here and this is gorgeous over here this little Winnie the Pooh section you can take photos look oh that is gorgeous I'll take a photo of that I love it and then we've got Winnie and Eeyore over here. People are taking photos, so I'll try to take some before we leave. And then we're just seated all the way down here. Um, we have a great table, actually. It's, it's okay. It's um, so um, comfortable where we are. We're just around here. So yeah, it's a great restaurant. So 10 out of 10, recommend. And there's Holly. <laughs> you all right? Oh my God, we just finished in Crystal Palace. Wasn't it gorgeous, Holly? Oh, that was absolutely unbelievable. I enjoyed it every single second of that. Our waiter, Michael, was the best. Oh, he was so helpful. He was so lovely, wasn't he, Holly? Yeah, he was great, he was. Honestly, could not recommend him enough. He was, I've no words. And basically, I had a little bit, bit of a panic moment. I can hear music, I think a cavalcade is coming. Um, I had a bit of a panic moment because I dropped my ticket, you know, like, to get into the parks on the floor and I literally was like oh my god what am I gonna do Holly I think Mickey's coming oh cavalcade is here we have a perfect spot Holly oh my god Mickey and Minnie is coming guys so we're gonna wait here but anyway I thought I lost my ticket and I nearly had a heart attack and he was like don't you worry I'll make sure I find it I'll explain after okay I'll explain after the cavalcade <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hi Daisy. We just seen the cavalcade and it was so cute. Oh, yeah. I loved it. All our favorite characters were in it. The... Goofy, wasn't it. Yeah, actually, I thought he would have been on the back of where Mickey was. Me too. That's actually strange that he wasn't on it. Um, but everyone else was. So that was good. Um, I just took pictures of my new nose at the castle. I'll show you guys my new nose in a while. I put them in the outfits I bought yesterday in Animal Kingdom, and they're gas looking, aren't they? Yeah, so funny. They're so funny. Um, so yeah, I got pictures of them in them. And yeah, so beforehand I was explaining that I thought I lost my ticket. Big catastrophe. I did find it. It was literally at the table next to us because I remember I tried to fix my shoe and uh, it was on the floor there underneath like this little girl's legs. So the table was empty when we first arrived and then a few months later this family came and I just happened to come back from getting another plate of food and I was like, Holly, I found it. It's on the floor. I was like, oh, thank God. So I took it off my lanyard 
I'm just going around. Me and Holly are going around with empty lan lan lanyards, but we just don't want to lose our tickets, so it's in my bum bag. Um, yeah, and our waiter, Michael, like I said, he was so lovely, and he was like, I'll try my best to find it. I have all the waiters looking out for it. And he just kept coming with Cokes and Sprites too. Yeah, he was great. He was. he was great. I think he felt sorry because I was like, oh my God, my ticket. How am I going to get into the parks? Holly, another scary oh. bear. These uh, country bears are out. We saw a different one the other day and now... The other one's on the other side, I think. Oh, is he? Think so. yeah, yeah. We didn't see him the other day, whoever he is. So yeah, I'll, I'll show you guys this, the country bears while we're at it. Here they are. Oh no, Holly, that's a different fella. On the other side. Yeah, on the other side, is it not? I actually don't know. It is a different fella. So there's two of the country bears. We literally don't know the first thing about them. So I haven't a clue who they are, but they're terrifying in my opinion. Big Thunder Mountain and we were in the front of the train. I don't think we've ever been in the front, have we? Maybe not. I don't think so. Um, the kids behind us were so annoying though, weren't they? Mm -hmm. Oh my God, They before um, the ride even started, they were roaring the place down and like squeaking, weren't they? Like squeaking out of it. Uh, and me and Holly were like, oh my God. And like, I actually thought I was gonna be deaf by the end of the ride. Like, I think my ears were literally blocked at one point. I was like, what are they doing? But now we are heading over to Seven Dwarfs Mine Train. Oh my God, I am so excited for the, for the mine train. This will be our first time ever on this and everyone is always hyping it up and it's always, the line is so long. So we have a lightning lane for it. So we're very, very excited for this. So that's two good roller coaster things in, in the first kind of few minutes or so of us. Uh, starting our rides in the park so I'll catch you guys when we're over at the mine train
God. Here we go. Seven Dwarfs Mine Train. Great. <laughs> it was unbelievable. That was so worth the wait, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Oh, uh, absolutely loved it. Ten out of ten for yeah, us. 10 out of 10. Honestly, it was so smooth as well, wasn't yeah, it? it was. You didn't even feel like you were going around. Um, I loved it. I'm so happy we got on that because the wait just be so long, and the lightning lanes to be snatched like that. So the fact that we managed to get on it was absolutely brilliant. So I'm delighted now. Loved it every second of it. <laughs> The best cavalcade we've ever seen best thing I've ever in seen our lives life. and we just were trying to get to jungle cruise for our lightning lane and i heard the music yeah and there was a crowd of people but me and holly swiveled okay yeah but i say to the front swiveled we got up to the front we were like mm -mm -mm. that was true yeah and uh, i couldn't believe it the princess float it was incredible it was. was the best thing i ever seen the like princesses that aren't recognized enough yeah um sorry i was pointing to holly at the toilets um first of all mulan and yeah. pocahontas pocahontas that was on. amazing i can't believe it and then moana, moana jasmine jasmine and elena, and elena. those How princesses ex excluding jasmine the others are never in paris and yeah, jasmine never, is very rare very rare these She's days only in the parade now yeah for the first time since like 2010. Yes, it's absolutely, it's, I don't even know, but sorry, we're coming into dark now, but that was absolutely, I don't even think you could see me. Miguel was in it, the Incredibles were in it. Standing here for a minute where there's Charlie like Patterson. so many great characters. Mag Miguel? The gorilla from Tarzan. Yes, Marie, Stitch, Marie, yeah. Mary Poppins and Bert. There were so many mm -hmm. rare characters. So oh, it was absolutely brilliant. I'm trying to think. That Miguel, I couldn't believe it. <laughs> that was That's the first time we've ever seen Miguel. He's that in was, Paris now. Though. He's in Paris now for the 30th. Um, what thing? Dance? I can't remember the name of it. And the Zootopia characters were in And the Zootopia characters. We've never seen majority of them. No, literally most of them. Like, we've seen The Incredibles before. Aladdin, Genie, Marie, Stitch. Mary and Bert with the rest. <laughs> oh my god, that was brilliant. We're actually in awe over that. I hope we see that again. I hope it's on again before the end of the day. Yeah, me too. Just to, just to see that. That was, oh, oh, guys, oh my god. Cheetahs. Avenge the things that killed Mufasa. That's really awkward. Oh. Oh my gosh, that's so special. The guns look like they got reservations to 
amazing uh, skipper madeline was so funny you enjoyed her didn't you yeah she was hilarious yeah the jokes she was coming out with were actually really funny um yeah it was really good nice to sit down and relax and just look at all the animals yeah yeah and that was i don't know if we ever did that before i'm sure we might have no idea but we've no memory of it so it was nice to do it and especially like since the movie came out. Have you seen the movie? Holly hasn't seen the movie yet. This might inspire her to watch it. Yeah, I will watch it. Yeah, I've seen it in the cinema and it's a great movie. Um, so it was great to do the ride. But now we are on our way to Space Mountain. Oh my God, we can't wait for this, can't we not? Yeah. This'll be, this'll be good. Um, so Hyper Space Mountain is one of our favorite rides in Disneyland Paris, but it's Star Wars themed. So this is the kind of original concept of Star Wars. So and also not Star open Wars when we went to Paris. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. It wasn't open when we last went to Paris in November, and this is the original Space Mountain concept. And um, so it'll be nice to do something different. Yeah, yeah. I remember we did it in 2014, the day we came. No, we did, we did, I remember. Big yeah, I think we did it in the dark. Yeah, um, just reminiscing, you know, yourself. Uh, but yeah, this this will be good. Like, we never done the Space Mountain when it was just Space Mountain in Paris. We've only ever done hyperspace, so I am looking forward to this. So we're heading over to Tomorrowland now. We, will we go this way or? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna go this way, past. Crystal Palace. Oh my God, that was amazing earlier. And look at the crowds around it now, Holly. Yeah, it looks real busy, but they kind of get you quick enough. True. Like they come out like every couple of seconds, calling the families. Yeah, there. we were what five minutes waiting yeah. for our table, and it was grand. Um, so everyone's going in for their dinner now. Yeah. Lucky, lucky. We're still full though, aren't we? Oh my God, yeah. Stuffed to the brim, and the food. I'm, I'll actually never get over it. The food was unreal in there, yeah, to be honest. So I guess, I don't know, I'll see you when we're, we're in Tomorrowland, which will be in two seconds for you guys. So we're heading into Tomorrowland and we've barely spent any time in here, have we? We walked through it. Yeah, we met Stitch the other day and that was it. So we'll go on um, Space Mountain and we'll see the wait times in a while. We might get even buzz or something in. Um, but yeah, we haven't spent any time here. So it'd be nice to, to see it. Because everyone actually loves Tomorrowland. It is actually, it has some good rides, so I'm not surprised why. And it's a lot bigger than Discovery Land, isn't it, Holly? Yeah, Discovery Land is so small compared to this. Like, we were just getting our bearings the other day, and this place was huge. There's the Monsters Inc. laugh floor. If that's a short wait later, we might do it. Yeah. Okay, we have made it. We're heading over to Space Mountain. I am buzzing. You guys have no idea how excited I am for this ride. It is going to be unreal. We're going in the Lightning Lane entrance. We'll see how long this takes. I wouldn't say it'd be too long. The standby line is currently at an 80 minute wait. So I wonder how long we'll be. Maybe 20 minutes if we're lucky. I'd love if it was only that short of a wait. But I'll catch up with you guys after because I'm going to enjoy this ride because it's been so long since I was last on the Space Mountain. So I will chat to you guys afterwards. Okay guys, so we got off Space Mountain and it was so good. Um, it's 
what I remember it to be from when I was last on it a few years ago um, it was good it really was I wish it went upside down like hyperspace mountain but I liked it um, yeah it, it was it was good it really was um, I enjoyed that and I'm glad I got the lightning lane for it instead of queuing for 80 minutes so we were in and out within like 20 minutes or so it was, it was absolutely grand and um, also I switched to my new ears that I bought yesterday the 50th anniversary ears I bought in World of Disney the tag is sticking out the side of it oh my god and um, I bought them in the World of Disney yesterday um, so I put them in my bag as well and they're really cozy so I'm gonna wear them because I'm at the 50th anniversary so it has to be done but I'm now just standing on Main Street right in front of the castle because the cavalcade with Mulan and Pocahontas is due to come any minute I think I can hear it coming it's due at 20 past it's there it's now 25 past so it takes a few minutes to get to Main Street so me and Holly were like we have to see that again so it's due to come any minute I can hear it coming Mickey and Minnie had just went past as we got off of Space Mountain um, yeah so cavalcades all around today it's, it's been a great day and after this cavalcade then i think we are heading to meet cinderella and elena now it's normally cinderella and elena that's posted outside on the wall but on the after day it said cinderella and a visiting princess but outside it's still saying elena so we're not too sure either way we don't really mind because we've never met elena before so here's here comes the cavalcade so we're excited we're gonna meet elena and if not we'll meet a visiting princess but the cavalcade is coming, so I'm gonna take my spot and let's see it again. seen on this trip so far like like we said the character's amazing i got great interaction off uh, pocahontas she was like wink gabo and all what she oh. said hello and all oh, i nearly died i was like oh my god she said hi to me yeah i was getting like there wasn't anyone beside me so they were all like waving at me and everything that's but the deadly. sun was reflecting on me so i didn't get good pictures so holly stood on the opposite side of the road to me yeah. to get pictures of mulan and all but the sun was shining in her face so it didn't work out for us but she got great interactions and that's all that matters for yeah. her um her photos probably didn't turn out that great, but still. Yeah. Um, we got great interactions on both sides, to be fair. Um, Stitch was waving at me and I was like, ah! So yeah, that was so cool. But now we are heading around to Princess Fairytale Hall or Fairytale Fair. Princess Pavilion from over here. Their Princess Pavilion, basically. Um, 
to meet Cinderella and what claims to be a visiting princess. I think it's Elena. We think it's Elena, it always is, so. But we've never met Elena before, so. Yeah. We're happy out, to be honest, so. I guess we'll see you guys there. <laughs> Got it. Got it. Yeah. 